you know, it can be painful to realize what happened to us as little munchkins that we, you know, turned away from our deep understanding in order to fit into the family. And, you know, what might come up is um, feelings of blame of our parents or other family members. And the thing is, you know, I've got this expression, blame is lame. Like, you know, we're all bumbling human beings and everybody's just doing their best. You know, even somebody who's doing terrible things in, a, in another way, they are doing their best um, in their existence because if they knew the cost of their actions, they wouldn't do them. So, you know, it's ignorance um, that makes us do unhelpful or hurtful things. And it's our ignorance as parents where we, you know, out of our own wounding, we might hurt our children. Or as children, we might have gotten hurt by our parents. But... There's an important thing I haven't really talked about. Now, in my experience, my direct experience, we have other lives. Like I've I've remembered many. So for me, it's like, a, you know, it just is. And so the families that we choose are colored by our past life experiences. So, you know, depending on our actions in other lives we we have um, our lessons for this life or we will have some karma um, and so our imprinting comes as a result of our actions in other lives so you know how this was brought back to me very poignantly and very like painfully is I, you know, I mentioned that I had trouble with my dad, bless his heart. Anyway, I remembered some lifetimes where I had been a man and not a, a nice man, a difficult man, and where I'd hurt my children. So it was like, there's no blame, you know? I mean, I just had to turn around and forgive myself in a really big way. But it, it did help me <laughs> come to terms with my own dad. It's sort of like I realized, well, you know, I'd done the same thing. So that's why he was my dad. <laughs> you know, show me this. <laughs> In the hopes the universe was hoping that, you know, I'd outgrow it, that I'd stop doing this. You know, and what, what I've done, the thing that made me kind of a difficult man who, where people got hurt around me, was I held on to ideas and religious beliefs. And they kind of took away my humanity. I held on them too strong. So, you know, in this life, I got a very intellectual dad who saw me through his head, not his heart. And I got family patterns coming down from his side of the family that were very kind of heavy fundamentalist patterns. So, you know, so I think that's why it's taken me so long to heal, really, because of the fundamentalist stuff. And the power of these uh, beliefs that that I've had throughout the ages. So you see, like you just have to, we just have to put our arms around ourselves, and you know, just forgive ourselves. You know. So I hope this helps. Bless your hearts. <laughs>